Hey guys, Brett here, and one thing that everybody that has any experience with affiliate marketing quickly learns is that sending traffic directly to a sales page is a really bad idea. And it doesn't matter where your traffic's coming from. It doesn't matter if it's paid ads. It doesn't matter if it's a Facebook group or social media. It doesn't matter if it's your blog, if it's SEO traffic from your website. It does not matter where that traffic is coming from. If you're an affiliate marketer and you're sending traffic directly to a sales page for a product that you're promoting, you are losing money and you're losing sales. And even worse, you're wasting an opportunity. Every affiliate marketer quickly learns that sending traffic directly to a sales page quite simply doesn't work very well at all. Now fortunately there is a system that is known to work and that top marketers use over and over and that's to use a bonus page or a bridge page. So they have their traffic source, they send their traffic to their bonus page or their bridge page and then from there people can click to go to the sales page for the product that the marketer is promoting as an affiliate. This is a proven tactic that's been known to work and it's something that top marketers do every single day. However, there is a really big problem with this tactic. And that unavoidable problem is lost traffic. When you send your traffic to a bonus page and then from the bonus page to the sales page, you will lose traffic along the way. People who have gone to your bonus page or your landing page or your bridge page won't necessarily click over to the sales page. You lose some potential customers because you have an extra step inside of the things that they need to do in order to actually get to the product that you're promoting. And the more steps you have, the more traffic you're going to lose along the way. And what's even worse is that this lost traffic can potentially cost you thousands of dollars in your business. Well, I started thinking about it and I realized that the solution is to combine the two things. The solution is to make my bonus or landing page also the sales page for the product that I'm promoting as an affiliate. And that's why I created Hijax. Hijax is a software that I created that allows me to hijack the sales page of products that I'm promoting as an affiliate and combine it with my bonus page. So this way I remove this step and even better I remove the lost traffic. Let me show you exactly how it works. Okay so this is me using my hijack software in an actual promotion for a product that I was promoting as an affiliate. And the product that I was promoting was Designo Pro 2. And as you can see, I have a video over the Designo Pro 2 sales page. This video would normally autoplay, but I have it paused just so that you don't have to hear it in the background. Now there's a couple of things I want you to notice though. Hijacks will automatically stop the video that is playing on the sales page. So most of the affiliate products that we promote in this space are going to have videos that auto play on the sales page. But I didn't want that. I wanted those videos to stop because I want people to initially focus on my video and focus on the bonus offer that I'm going to give them if they pick up this product. So hijacks will automatically stop any autoplay videos on the sales page and it will show my video and my video will autoplay first. Okay, so this video is telling them about the bonus that they can get if they pick up Designo Pro 2 through my link. And just by coming to this page, the people are automatically cookied to my link. They don't have to click anything at this point. They are cookied to me right now. Now there's two possibilities on what can happen. They could watch the entire video or they can click on this X button and close out the video. And regardless of which happens, the same thing will happen as a result. Let me go ahead and show you. I'll go ahead and click on the X button so you can see exactly what happens. Okay, and as you can see, my video box offering my bonus goes away. The sales page comes to life. The sales video auto plays just like it should and up top is a timer bar reminding them of when my bonus expires. This gives them some scarcity that lets them know that time is running out so if they want my bonus they need to go ahead and pick up this product right away. Now there's nothing else for them to do. At this point it's just as if they came directly to the sales page. If they go ahead and pick up the product it's a normal transaction and since they are already cookie to me I will get the affiliate credit. 
So I know what you're thinking here right now. You're thinking, okay, well, that's all great and well, Brett, but does it actually work? Does this actually work better than sending people to a bonus page and then sending them from the bonus page to the product that you're promoting as an affiliate? Well, I'm not going to answer that. I'm going to let the stats answer that for you. So this is the results of my promotion for Design O Pro 2. And as you can see, I sent 179 front-end sales to Design O Pro 2 using this software and this tactic. I sent a total of 298 sales that were funnel sales using this software and using this tactic. I did $4,000 in commissions, so that was $8,000 in sales in three days. And if you look, it's because I had amazing traffic. I had 2,314 site visitors to the, my affiliate link. I converted the same as everyone else. I had about the same conversion as every other person promoting this product, but I had a ton of traffic. And that's because I wasn't losing people by having that extra step, by sending people to a bonus page and then requiring them to manually click from the bonus page over to the sales page for Design O Pro 2. By removing that extra step, all of my traffic went directly to the sales page, yet they still got the benefit of the bonus page because they still saw my bonus offer and my bonus video first automatically. This resulted in a ton of traffic. It resulted in a ton of sales on this particular product.